it may mean trouble for Tesla is ahead. Hollywood actress Mary McCormick posting a video of her husband's Model S. This after it burst into flames. Phil LeBeau joins us now. He's got some of the details on this. Phil. And yet, David, despite the fact that this was a video that went viral over the weekend, got a lot of attention, Tesla shares are up today. Here is the video, and this actually happened on Friday. Then Mary McCormick posted it on social media, and then other news outlets picked it up. This fire happened in West Hollywood on Friday. Uh, we should point out Mary McCormick's husband was not injured in this fire. He got out of the car uh, once people alerted to him to the fact that there was a fire, what appears to be under the front wheel section. Tesla says this is an extraordinarily unusual occurrence, and we are investigating the incident to find out what happened. Our initial investigation shows that the cabin of the vehicle was totally unaffected by the fire due to our battery architecture. We followed up with a question if you're investigating, do you have the vehicle? Are you looking at the vehicle? We've not heard back from Tesla. The other story over the weekend, Elon Musk emailing employees saying, look, we need radical improvements needed in the output of our Model 3 production. The target is 700 a day by early July. They currently are 500 plus, according to Elon Musk. As you take a look at shares of Tesla, again, the big thing that everybody is focused on is what happens come July when the company reports Q2 deliveries, and will it hit that target of 700 per day, basically 3,500 per week, that, or that, that allows, or 5,000 per week, excuse me, that allows them then to be cash flow positive, and that's why you're looking at shares of Tesla now back over $360 a share. Guys, this is the basically the high point year to date for Tesla shares. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.